Siskel and Ebert had a bit of history with Emmerich by the time Godzilla went into production. His 1994 picture, Stargate, was met with dismissive summary by Ebert. Although the 1996 blockbuster Independence Day fared slightly better in terms of star rating, the critics picked apart the movie's logic and reliance on 40-year-old action tropes. You would think at this point that Emmerich would resolve to make a really good action movie that was exciting, refreshing, and above all else, actually made sense. However, as his filmography since then has proven, this is not his approach to movie making. The man has made a career out of silly, large-scale action epics that skip the logic and sophistication in favor of spectacle. It must have been an amusingly surreal experience for those present at the Keynes Film Festival in May of 1998 to be in the room with Ebert when he first saw Godzilla. 